It almost feels wrong to open this thing up. It is so clean looking. Look at how beautiful it looks. I mean, it is just, it is so aesthetically pleasing. This is probably one of the best designed elite trainer boxes I have ever seen that Pokemon has ever come out with. It is, it is crazy good. What is going on fan clan? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Danny Phantom. Today, we are going to be breaking into this bad boy and then giving everything that we open away to one of you. And if you want to enter, all you have to do is just leave a like and leave a comment uh, and make sure you're subscribed to the channel. Then, uh, next week Sunday, we are going to announce the winner of, uh, of whatever we pulled. I mean, if we pull an alternate art Charizard out of this, we're giving it away. My chase card is the character rare Umbreon VMAX. If we pull that, I don't get to keep it, unfortunately. We're just giving it away. And the reason why is because Pokemon gave this to us for free to open up and take a brand new sneak peek at this wonderful set, Brilliant Stars, which comes out on February 25th. So with that being said, let us, let's flip you guys around. And there it is. Oh my goodness, <laughs> look at how cool it looks. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. If you think, uh, if you agree with me that this is like the bestly created, bestly created, that's a, that's a phrase people say, right? If not, we should start saying it. If this is one of the best designs when it comes to an Elite Trainer Box that Pokemon has ever done, because it is, it is pretty good. All right, so we are going to remove the protective jacket here. We'll kind of go over the contents. I do want to just kind of take a peek at the, the booklet here because I told some people that I would at least show it. Um, even though we know what's in the set already, I'm not going to read through everything here, but if we just kind of look through everything, this is going to be a very interesting master set to pull. And as you can tell, just by watching some box openings on YouTube or on online, wherever you're watching them, maybe you open up some product by yourself already, uh, the, the pull rates in this set are very, very good. We're still getting between seven to eight hits per booster box, uh, but then it looks like we're also getting three to four character rares per booster box, so that, that trainer gallery subset that we've seen. Uh, so it looks like from my understanding and we'll know more information as I get more booster boxes open and compile the pull rate data for you guys uh, it looks like this master set should be somewhat attainable uh, at the same level as what maybe fusion strike was not as bad as what we saw with evolving skies look at those characters holy buckets so, so good everything is so good in this set oh I absolutely love this set but the good thing about that is that it makes you feel uh, like you're getting a lot more bang for your buck because you are getting more hits uh, per booster box. You're getting your, your typical seven to eight, but then you're also getting um, three to four character rares. So it really, it feels, you know, 10, 11, 12 hits per, per booster box, which is really, really good. And we'll go over actual data, like I said, when we, when we have it all compiled. Even these sleeves look super good. Look at that. Ooh, those are just, like I said, so aesthetically pleasing. Let me know what you think down in the comments section down below. Uh, in the description, there will also be a link for Gleam. Uh, we are going to be doing a massive Brilliant Stars opening giveaway, whatever you want to call it, where every winner is guaranteed an Ultra Rare. There's going to be 50 winners. We're going to open up packs until we pull an Ultra Rare, um, and you get every card that has been opened for you. So ways to earn entries, just click on the description below. We are going to give a code word right now for some additional entries. You can earn entries from like uh, subscribing on YouTube, following on Twitter, following on Instagram, uh, retweeting a tweet, entering a code word. The code word for this video is going to be Shaman. So if you enter in Shaman, you're going to get three uh, three bonus entries, which is pretty cool. We're just going to go in order here. We'll try and go through this relatively quick. I do intend on doing the pack trick just because I don't do it very much. Uh, no, nah, I'm not going to do the pack trick. We're just going to go right through it right away and just kind of jump into things. Uh, so appreciate the art a little bit. We got Staryu, Burmy, Sock, Cherubi, Ryol. Oh, Zekrom <laughs> character rare first pack magic. Let's go. Oh, absolutely gorgeous. And a Torterra hollow rare right behind it. You can even see. I don't know if those are print lines right there or what. Look at that. Look at the, how it... Oh, look at the light. <laughs> that is so good. I even love the energies of this set. Grottle, Clang, Cynthia's Ambition. And there is your code card right there. Look at this. Zekrom right away. Oh, my goodness. Let's get a sleeve on this bad boy. That is so good. Character rare right away. ETBs I've had just terrible luck with in the past. And typically, I, I get like one ultra rare total. Uh, but usually it's actually none. Uh, but here you should get like two hits, two to three hits maybe because of the character rares that are included in here. Going with this lovely Charizard pack art now. Let's hope we can pull 
Let's have a really good ETB because we're giving all this stuff away to one of you anyways. So the better the ETB, uh, I mean, that would be awesome. Snorunt, Ooh, pulling too many cards, nose pass. Dedene, look at that Dedene. It is so good with the Skyline back there. I absolutely love it. Cubchu, oh, Roseanne's back up. Even the, the foiling pattern here is so good. We've got, oh, a Mewtwo. I love the artwork on that Mewtwo also. And then we've got a V-Star marker, which are randomly inserted just in, in some packs, which is really, really cool. Kind of throws off the weights a little bit, uh, which helps a lot. I know there was some issues, some concern, especially with Fusion Strike, where people were kind of showing how some of the packs might be weighable. And that kind of eases your mind a little bit when you're purchasing this type of product to know that there's this extra insert in there, which makes it a little bit more hard to kind of track what what rarities could be in the pack. Cubchu, another awesome looking Dedene, an awesome looking Farfetch'd, there's a Cherubi, and we got our first, oh, Entei V, very nice! Darkness Energy, a cool looking Bear Trick, Fracture, and Pachirisu, ooh, and our first, uh, technically Ultra Rare, I guess, if you don't want to count the Trainer Gallery cards as Ultra Rare, but this is starting off to be a very, very good Elite Trainer box. Entei and Zekrom, let's see if we can keep things going. Uh, with pack number four, there are eight packs in your typical Elite Trainer box. If you ordered a special Elite Trainer box off of Pokemon Center, I believe you get ten packs. Piplup, Shroomish, Purloin, Duskull, Sneasel, Cubchoo, and a Dusknor Hollow. Look at that. Even that, just the way that it glares, the way the lights reflect, very, very cool. Metal Energy, Ultra Ball Reprint, Vibrava, and a Tropius. All right, so we're halfway through. Maybe we can get four hits out of this Elite Trainer Box, which would be super cool. Uh, would be really nice to pull a gold card or an alternate art of sorts, or maybe even one more character rare. That would be really nice. Let's see what we get. Pack number five, we've got Ball Toy, Axew, Nose Pass, Snorunt, Clink, Blunder Policy, and a Manafi, Manafi, Sigilyph, Acerola's Premonition, Morgrim, and there is our code card. All right, so we got three packs left. Let's see if we can pull something else good. We got two hits so far, which isn't bad, uh, but I would like to get at least one more. I think that would really kind of set it apart as an elite trainer box that is good. Uh, looking over other people's pulls, my booster box was good, and it felt really good because we had quite a few hits. If you haven't watched that yet, definitely go back and watch it. We released it on Friday. Weavile and Professor's Research Hollow. Hey, I haven't pulled one of those yet. Really nice. But looking over some of the other boxes that uh, were opened, we definitely left we left a little bit on the field with that booster box. So we'll have to open up some more when we get our shipment in uh, over the next week or so uh, and open some up for the storefront. Hopefully we can record some more content and pull some, some better fire. But uh, we didn't pull a single full art out of that booster box. So I think that it was actually, even though we had some a really good hit rate, we had like 11 hits in that box, it, it left, like I said, left some on the table. I think that that's one of the... One of the worst box, worser boxes. Uh, so I think that if you are ordering booster boxes, or if you did order booster boxes, ah, Sharon's care. Let's go, full art trainer pull. Uh, if you ordered booster boxes, I think the 11 hits is kind of on the low end for you. Look at that Luxio. That is so good, which is very encouraging for people. Pot helmet. Uh, that 11 hits is low. Let's look at this Sharon's care. This is really good. Oh. Let's get a sleeve on this bad boy. The the trees in the background, which is really, really cool. Oh my goodness. Charon. Centering. It looks a little bit off, but not too bad compared to some of the other sets we've seen. Not bad at all. Charon's care. I would say that this is a good ETB so far. If we can get one more hit. This is last pack. We need some last pack magic. Pause the video. Everybody comment last pack magic. That'll earn you an entry to win these pulls anyway, so you might as well just comment it. And then hit that like and subscribe button. And we'll see. Maybe we can get lucky. One more pack. We've got Chimeco, Chimchar, Mincino, Baltoy, Snorunt, oh, Shroomish, and an Alchemy. So we didn't have any last pack magic on this one. But we did have some first pack magic, 
which is really cool. Ending it off with a bear trick. There it is, guys. Thank you so much for all of the support. We got some really good hits in there. Thanks so much to the Pokemon Company International for sending this to us. Again, we're going to give all these pulls away to one lucky person. Just make sure you comment down below, leave a like, and make sure you're subscribed to the channel. And don't forget to read up on the link from Gleam that goes over our massive Brilliant Stars giveaway. Guys, this is all because of you guys. All the support you have given us, uh, that has really led to this point. So thank you so much. As we continue to grow, we'll just keep giving more and more away. Get as many Pokemon cards in the community as we can. You guys are amazing. I appreciate you. I will see you soon. Peace!